What's going on guys? Oh my god, Zilla back here with a really fun video I wanted to do. Definitely different from the regular style of the channel, but I'm a huge Scream fan. So the minute I heard that Scream was doing a promotion with Cinemark and doing in-theater items, I had to rush out and check some of these out, guys. Let's check them out. Alrighty, guys, so we're here. We're... Alrighty, guys, so we're back here with the four items you can get at the Cinemark movie theaters it's the two ghost face cups one bloodied one regular the ghost face popcorn tub and the stuffed figure let's take a look at each one So guys, here is the first item. This is the Ghostface cup. It's a uh, soda cup you can get drinks in. They actually sold them to me, and they didn't actually put anything in them, which I was definitely glad they did not, because uh, I wouldn't have wanted to have to spend the time cleaning out the drink. But the soda thing looks great. Ghostface is really cool. You can definitely see kind of some of the glitter on the robe there. We'll take a better look at the cup here. Kind of the classic glitter robe that we see on a lot of the Ghostface outfits. So really cool. You can see that. You got the shoes. The mask looks really good eye holes or even kind of have some detail on them definitely appreciate some of the detail put into there there's the top you can actually pop this up it doesn't actually fill a ton of drink i've never actually tried drinking out of it but it actually doesn't fill too high up with uh, which with much drink you can check out this back thing here just kind of some kind of trademark dealios not fusion dishwashers hand wash only no microwave use there's the bottom so there's our ghost face the classic regular ghost face drink holder <clears throat> Guys, up next is the bloodied ghost face drink holder. Same deal as the regular one, but it does have that blood splatter all over it. There, you can see I do have one of the straws in there that comes with it. It does come with a kind of nice fancy black straw. It's a little thicker than a regular straw would be. Same deal on the back, guys. Let's take a little look at the front. Obviously, they're going to be the exact same body, same mold, same everything. Just have this cool blood splatter across it. I actually had to drive to a theater way far away from me because they did not have this particular one. I got the regular one. I got the popcorn thing, but I had to go to a different theater way up out of the way to find the bloodied ghost face and the plush however i will say i uh, ended up lucking out in the long run because i know a lot of the a lot of theaters are definitely sold out of the bloodied and the plush and maybe even more uh, sold out of everything and this stuff is selling for a ton on the second market right now guys let's take a look at the popcorn tub <clears throat> Guys, the popcorn tub is really huge. Definitely an eye grabber. Really love it on my little scream shelf I have. Definitely really awesome. Check out the back, guys. Do you like scary movies? Embroidered right on there, and it looks really, really good. And Ghostface actually looks phenomenal. The detail on this popcorn thing is incredible. Let's take a closer look at the ghost face here. So you kind of have some of that texture in the eyes. The mouth is super untextured, which is, looks really good, actually. Total awesome texture all across the hood, everywhere. No detail missed along the texture of the hood. You have this kind of top part to do the popcorn. Again, they did not do the popcorn. They did a popcorn on the side, actually, when I bought this, which I really appreciated because I was not looking forward to having to clean this thing out of all the greasy butter popcorn. Really cool that they have the Do You Like Scary Movies on there in the back. Totally three-dimensional, really textured. Looks awesome. And I can't believe they're doing this stuff. I was so psyched to figure out they're doing Scream stuff. I, I've loved Scream forever. I love horror movies. And Scream is definitely my favorite. I have a ghost face tattoo. Um, so I totally love Scream, and this thing is amazing. Such great detail for being fairly inexpensive. I think both of the cups and the and the, this and the plushie were all about fifteen dollars each. So that is amazing. And actually, this this piece sold so well. Cinemark actually decided to do a second wave of them, and they are selling them on their website right now. So I will link that below, guys. You can go get one of these before they sell out on their website below for twenty dollars, I think, online, or if you can find one at your local Cinemark theater, they are a little more expensive. Let's take a look at the plush, you guys. <clears throat> Alrighty, guys, here we are with the plush figure. 
and there was no way I was gonna get this guy to stand up on that uh, on the spinner so I just decided we'll take a look at him right here he's got a couple little fuzzes and all my cats and stuff taking getting stuff all over him but the robe is like a really nice like faux silk kind of feels like maybe it's even real silk I don't know but it's definitely like a nice sleek material you can definitely tell it kind of has a shine to it really awesome it would have been really sweet had they put in a little bit of the glitter like they have on the actual ghost fake costume that would have been awesome but nothing there the hands feet and face are all just kind of a soft material you can kind of tell there we do have a cool tag underneath on one of the legs doesn't really say too much fun world and then the back surface washable only don't machine wash it um but we do have a really cool tag a great image of ghost face promotional image for upcoming scream movie there's a scream on the back it's interesting it doesn't say doesn't say the, doesn't say scream six it just says scream but it does say 2023 paramount pictures really cool and then the face of this ghost face looks awesome you kind of have almost a leather mouth and eyes on there the nose is a little bit of that leathery too but it's a very soft material on this ghost face so really cool definitely glad i was able to pick this up um i definitely would say don't pay too much for these guys on online unless you really really want them they're definitely they're nice pieces but unless you really want them the aftermarket prices have gotten brutal on this and since cinemark did the re-release on the popcorn tub there's a chance they're going to see how popular these were and send more of them to the theaters before Scream actually comes out in a couple of weeks. So I would definitely not pay the crazy online prices. I feel bad for anyone who did pay the online prices for the popcorn tub, especially. And then they went ahead and re-released it for 20 bucks and you, somebody just paid 80. I was looking at some of the sale prices on these guys on eBay in the second market. Those scalpers got really greedy and did a lot of people in for some pretty brutal prices on these guys. <clears throat> Now guys, in terms of scaling, I grabbed the ultimate NECA ghost face to kind of scale it up next to him. So he towers over the cup just a little bit. The plush is actually going to be taller than him. And if you put him on ground level with the popcorn tub, popcorn's a little bit taller, but not by much, guys. I just wanted to have one other ghost face item to go ahead and compare him to. Love the NECA ghost face, by the way. And if you're a usual subscriber to the channel, you're much used to me comparing stuff to these Godzilla figures. Here, here's all the ghost face stuff up next to a six inch bandai japan 2019 godzilla figure guys i definitely would recommend these to any scream fan i love them super stoked i was able to get them very grateful for that let me know in the comment section below if you picked these up and what your thoughts on them are guys super stoked for them super stoked for the movie let me know if you are a regular subscriber on the channel you want to see more kind of stuff that's not straight godzilla stuff that'd be awesome to get that feedback guys thank you so much for watching stay tuned for more and we'll see you in the next one